Now, it's the age-old tale that behind every successful man is a successful woman. I sat down with Anne Marie Sanford to see if this rings true for the WKU football couple. Our parents um, introduced us and um, kind of the rest is history. With dads who are lifelong friends and former football teammates, it's no wonder why this couple devotes most of their time to the field. When I graduated college, I moved up to Boise State and he finished out um, his uh, playing career there and then decided to go into coaching. And then we married each other and 11 or no, 10, 11 moves later, um, we are here at Western Kentucky. Anne Marie says that the moves are never easy, but her kids and husband make the extra efforts worth it. My daughter has lived in um, all four different time zones and she's seven. She's moved five times and she does it better than probably Mike and I combined. Our boys are too small to even know, but you know, I always say with Mike, my home is wherever he is. And so yes, the moves are hard, but it's not, not um, he does a great job at transitioning us. When facing a loss or angry fans, Mike and Anne Marie have their own way of coping with the negativity. Mike and I, we call it our true north. Um, so we kind of uh, block out the criticism and we look to our true north and our true north is our children and our marriage and our family and our faith. And um, the good thing is, is that we are winning and it's hard. I always say it's hard to win a football game. And so I'm just proud when we win. However we win, we win. And that that's huge for me. As a busy mom, Amory feels that her contributions to the team stem from her support for her husband. We're coaching them, or Mike's coaching them, but you know they're they're playing. They're they're on the you know the sidelines or in the game, and you know that's a huge deal. And so if I can support Mike and support them and and pray for them and um, just just be there for them, I think um, and I think that's you know right now what I can do just because of having small kids. Reporting for the Extra Point, I'm Temple Rickey.